Okay, uh, so you guys have been hearing me talk about like this giant carousel. So this is what it kind of looks like. Here's what the computer screen looks like. These are non-narcotics. These are just uh, all the fills that are going to the pixel floors. You can see all the room numbers here, the destinations, right? All the drugs are pulling here. And again, it's coming from this giant carousel and house. And this thing spins every time that they select a drug. So a label prints here. And then once they select the drug, they scan it out. And then it'll spin to the next drug. So I will do one here for you guys. So here it says Lovenox 60 milligrams, 0.6 ml syringe. All right. I come over here to my label. I grab it. It shows my location. 1591. I walk over to 1591. It tells me I need to pull two syringes, quantity two. Syringes, right? And this thing tells me to waiting for an item scan. So I scan my item with my scanner. Now it says waiting for pick label scan. And now I scan the label to match it up. And I put those together, and then the carousel spins and goes to the next item. It has an inhaler, sixteen eight one. I pull my atrovent inhaler, 16A1, do the same thing, I scan the item, scan the label, and together, another label prints. So this is what one technician does all day long here too. They're constantly just pulling. They're just pulling over and over, and over again. Not okay, you close to 16 12 point. Spins. So the way the machine works, it always pulls from left to right. And then when you finally get to the far right, it spins again, right? And then it'll print the label. So this one's gonna start like over here somewhere, right? That's the way it kind of works. And it just keeps going down the list over and over and over again until you get through this entire pull. As you see, so there's still 21 items to be pulled. And this, start, this pull started at 1 p.m. That's just what kind of what they're working on right now.